thousands of people gather to watch the iconic ball drop at Times Square in New York City, officially starting the new year here in the United States. It was one of many places around the world they kicked off 2022 in style. Well, people in Dubai are also already off and partying. A beautiful fireworks show display lit up the sky from the city's largest skyscraper, the Burj Khalifa. A cool laser show also accompanied the fireworks going off. People who showed negative PCR tests were encouraged to get out and have some fun, watch the display, and film on their phone. And here at home, New Year's Eve celebrations are underway, and some events are sold out despite rising COVID-19 cases. Well, health officials have encouraged people to take part in small gatherings, whether vaccinated or not, to help reduce the spread of the virus. News 8's La Monica is in downtown San Diego to tell us what's happening right now. This time last year, most celebrations were hampered by the pandemic, and although the crowds are smaller than they have been in the past, lots of people came out tonight to celebrate and bring in the new year. I cannot wait to kick this year down the road and move on with 2022. I'm very excited, I'm so happy. We've made it through another year, and even with the challenges related to the pandemic, people in San Diego's gas lamp quarter are ready to let loose and welcome in the new year. Hotels and restaurants in Gaslamp are hosting parties and offering dinner specials, something many people say they've been looking forward to all year long. We're just outside having a good time. Um, we have been cooped up in the house for the last two years, so we decided to just come out um, the safest way possible. As COVID-19 cases continue a dramatic rise, county health officials highly recommend that people continue to implement safety protocols like wearing a mask, getting tested, and getting vaccinated. They also encourage people to gather in small groups and avoid large gatherings this holiday weekend. I, I have a lot of concerns, but let's just be honest. To be honest with you, there's so much going on. I'm vaccinated. I still got COVID. I know people that aren't vaccinated. People are being out. I don't think our economy can handle another shutdown. So I think it's one of those things I just got to take it on the chin and hope everybody's as safe as they possibly can be. People are also being encouraged to get home as safely as possible after New Year celebrations. For those in need of a short distance ride, Lyft and Bird also have discounts on electric scooters. I do have a designated driver. It's my mom. So we'll um, definitely encouraging others to, you know, use Lyft and Uber or any other way to stay safe out there. Health officials have also warned that after the holidays, we're more likely to see a major increase in COVID cases. Officials say that the Omicron variant is responsible for the positive rate here in San Diego County. LaMonica Peters, CBS 8.